Hey, Stacy and Patrick. Uh, so it sounds like you have an existing calendar with a lot of information on it, and you want to move all of that onto one of your course calendars that was created for you by Teacher Dashboard. I think I may have a way. So follow along with this. Um, first, identify the calendar that you want to copy from. And so in this example, I'm going to go from my absences tech to my import test. So I want to copy everything out of absences tech. I'm going to click on this menu and go to calendar settings. I'm going to scroll down to where it says private address. Click on the iCal button. You're going to get this big long link. You want to right click on that and say save link as. And I'm just going to give it the name um, it comes in as basic. I don't really know what that means. I'm just going to leave it there. I've already got a version that I saved previously. I'm just going to write over that. So I'm going to hit save and replace it. And I can go ahead and close this. Now I'm going to go back to my calendar. And down here where it says other calendars, I'm going to right click or I'm going to click on that menu and say import calendar. And I'm going to choose the file off my desktop called basic and I'm going to import it into the calendar I want which is import test alright here goes nothing I'm going to go ahead and click on import and I'm waiting and I'm still waiting okay according to this it processed 493 events uh, and it successfully imported all of those events. So now, if I scroll through my calendar to see if I can find... Alright, well here's an example. So, tomorrow I have a vacation day. You can see that the yellow corresponds with my absences tech and the green is the import test. So it looks like it imported that information onto my absences tech, uh, onto, into my import test calendar. So at this point, I would say go ahead and give it a try and uh, see if that works for you. Give me a holler if you need anything. Good luck.